What's going on, Paisanos? V here. We're at the sneak preview. This kid over here just can't catch a break. Talking about you. Secret sauce is pretty good. Secret pass. Make sure to donate to the channel by clicking the link below and buy for 2C player. So I can put kids like this to send them to school. Buy them shoes and socks and undies, tidy whities I'm his younger brother. Yeah, it's my younger brother. My dad bumped Chase in Kentucky and had him. And then left immediately because it's Kentucky. Who wants to be here for more than a week? For your donation or click on the channel link down below to support the channel by buying crap on TCG players. You don't really need for decks that probably might not get you invites. You too can support him. Thank you. Thank you. Hey everybody, about the sneak preview. Everyone's excited. They're winning the packs. They're playing their games and trying to win these mats. What I usually do is, stores have their little method of how they give out the extra mat. Normally, it's worst place wins a mat, and then the other guy is supposed to get a mat randomly, so I make him roll D20s. And I, you know, do red and blue. Uh, I usually lie to them and tell them one's more special than the other. They, they, they go, oh, let me get the special blue, and they roll it. It's, just, it's 2D20. Here's your buddy. Talk to this guy. Redo number two. I'm good. <laughs> Ask him he plays Yu-Gi-Oh. That's all you need to do. Say, do you play Yu-Gi-Oh? Just ask him. So, come on, we're trying to get you out in the world. Do you play Yu-Gi-Oh by any chance? No, I don't play PC I'm asking games. PC gaming because I just got a um, driver. Something with the... I know. Oh, for Rising Rampage? The temptation is strong. Rising Rampage sneaky mats. Uh, like, have a good amount of them. Alright, guys, I'm over here with, uh, what's your name again? Daniel Witt. Daniel? So, Dan, you're into a new thing, right? Oh, yeah. Alright, what do you used to do, Daniel? Man, I used to do heroin, 20 years straight. Heroin, pills, crack, meth, you name it. Got marks, scars for life for life. I went to my counselor two years ago. My dad had just passed away. They said, you need a hobby. I'm like, okay. Met, ran into some friends I knew from back in the day, good people, playing Yu-Gi-Oh. He's teaching his kids to play Yu-Gi-Oh. So I said, okay, let's play some Yu-Gi-Oh. Here I am, playing Yu-Gi-Oh. Got my fat stack card. <laughs> Clean. Two years. Clean two years. God bless, years. brother. Clean. Yep. You got you got a better drug now. <laughs> I got a better drug. With a way better high. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> better high. Cracking packs. Love it. Cracking packs beats anything else. Anything. <laughs> like we saying, drop that coral sword, son. It's over. Mm, that's the high right there. Pulling the bars with the high and then playing it for Play game. It. Woo! Woo! That's what I'm saying. <laughs> You're a good man, brother. I just gotta be me, man. Yeah. Things that suck about being a car show owner. When you accidentally sell these cars before the hype, you have to cancel someone else's order, and they're gonna be really angry because they bought it for about uh, $6 and three of them. <laughs> Sorry. All right, so we got like 10 packs of Rising Rampage for prismatic hunting, basically. Because Rhymus is currently listed as 696969969 right now on DC Player. I think on eBay it's listed for $500 for the Prismatic, um, Prismatic Secret Rare. Dream Mirror of Joy and Tenyi. Let's see, come on, boys. Let's pull that Prismatic card. Crap.
a vida. Trying to pull it, boys. I'm trying to get the prismatic. Jesus, super rare is all over the place. Can I get a secret rare? That marine sets rock car would be pretty nice. I would like that and prismatic in the same package. Nope. I'm gonna draw a second one. These are the worst packs I've ever, ever. Worst pre release ever. Storm Dragon's Return. That card's actually not, looks pretty good. I'm not sure if it's good because he might have played though. Hey. What in a blue moon, boys? Gizmek. All right, got a secret rare, I guess. One pack left. Can I get anything good? Can I get a prismatic? Morpheus. Hold on, hold that camera. Look, guys, I found more packs. I just can't believe I found more packs. It's the craziest thing. I just they were on the floor. All right, let's do more. Vita again, ten eyes. I think I'll have the whole ten eye deck for right tonight. Are you kidding me? Script sculpture, card's terrible. It's pre song for five. That's how you know it's like not good. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Ready? Jesus. This card's pretty good. Look at the artwork. I actually like the artwork a lot on this card. Come on. I'm serious. Can I get something good? No, well, they're like insanely hard. I got a secret rare. Fortune Lady Every. That's pretty cool. Hey, it's pretty good. It's not the card I want, though. I want a Prismatic. Bow goddess lady thing. I just want to see how it looks. I'm, I'm curious, YouTube. I'm just very curious. Hold on, I, I think I see something. You guys aren't going to believe this. I found 10 more packs. I, I don't even know where I found it from. You know what? We shouldn't even question it. Let's just do that. Let's not even question it. Let's start opening, opening just cracking packs. I mean, is this current? I'm not sure I have that card. Okay. By the way, you can find these cards by clicking on my TCD. Hey, this is, a, this is the main card. Borderlord Exchange, Excharge, whatever the hell is Dragon. Um, you can find these cards on my TCD Play Store. Also, click the link below to help support the channel so I can do more cool things like this. This card's actually really good, White Howling. You banish a water monster, right? You can draw all my target once spell, and you can banish it, and if you do, first a turn, your opponent can't spells aren't they're not happening. Hey, I got the essential cards. It's my playset. I'm not sure that card's good, it just looks really nice. It's like every time packs is like a secret, I think is like the current rate right now we're seeing here. Last pack. Hold on. I think I see something. Look what I found, guys. Seriously, don't question it. <laughs> Dream Mirror Terra. Oh, this is the sexiest summon. I'm like, what? 
There we go, Romulus. I needed that card. I think that's the only card I actually care about in this set. That card's gonna, this is gonna be money, boys. You just need one, I think. I don't think you need two. All right, Marine Cess and Prismatic. Prismatic Marine Cess be sweet. That's cool, Border Exchange. I think pretty nice. Pretty nice, boys. Free knife. There we go. Marbled Rock. That's, that's a sweet secret rare. Now, we got a couple of packs left. Four packs left. And I need to pull them Prismatic because I want to see how they look because I really am very curious. White Aura. Monocero. I like how it sounds kind of Spanish. Manoceros. All right. I just need you such a support, correct? Dream mirrors. I think I have all the mirrors now. For a deck I don't know how to play at the moment. I might build it. Nope. I right, so everything we got here, uh, all the packs I found, here's what we pulled. So we pulled the Marine Test card. Yay. Two Borderlord Exchange, Dragon Knight Romulus, Fortune Lady, and this other guy whose name I can't even pronounce. All right, guys, over here we have three types of sleeves. These are the common types of sleeves that everyone's gonna be using at their events. And for different prices, it's different quality. Um, actually, five. This, this is the price I charge in my shop, but I know some shops might charge more, might charge less. It really varies per shop. I know uh, there's also KMCs and um, there's also hyper masks, and I get those sleeves too, but these are commonly the most used sleeves. And here's my experience with them and what I think about these sleeves. We'll go with the first one. These are Ultra Pros. Uh, these are the Ultra Pro matte ones. They're, for the most part, about $5. And to be honest with you, these are like the McDonald's sleeves. Everyone eats at McDonald's. Everyone has McDonald's. There's nothing special about McDonald's. You just go there and boom. It's about five bucks. Use it for a while and then you throw them away. No big deal. Then you want to up your value a little bit. You'll get the Eclipse sleeves. This is actually, I charge $6. They're an extra dollar. Um, Eclipse sleeves are a little bit better than McDonald's sleeves. They feel a lot better. They don't. I think they last about the equally amount of the same. I think Eclipse sleeves are They're not bad sleeves at all. I just think that these sleeves eventually get the corners really get crumped up really easily and the gunk on your fingers. As you see how mine is clipped, by the way, a little pro tech when you're playing Yu Gi Oh! at events, clip your nails so dirt won't get in your sleeves, they last longer. But anyway, um, I feel like these sleeves uh, get a lot of dirt on them easily. The front of them, the matte part about these sleeves uh, is probably the best thing about them because they last longer. But the worst thing about them because you get dirt on them really, 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 really easily. And then up next, Dragon Shields. They're about $7 from most places. Um, they have Jet Matte. The newest one came out was Midnight Blue. I still have that, so I have Jet Matte over here. But Jet Matte's pretty good, too. It's one of the sleeves that it basically looks like space when we look at it, when we look at space at nighttime on clear skies. That's basically how these sleeves look like. There's different colors, by the way, as well. Anyway, um, I feel like these sleeves last longer than both these sleeves. And not only do they last longer, the dirt on your fingernails don't really affect these sleeves as much, being the fact that the matting on these is, is a lot thicker. So you'll get a lot more dirt, which means the sleeves won't last longer, which means they'll break easier, the corners will get crumped easily, all that stuff happening. So, I mean, that's really the sleeves and whatnot, and you guys could really tell whether you want to buy that. Ultra, uh, Eclipse has multiple colors, and Ultra Ball has multiple colors. Out of all these, Dragon Shoes are my recommendations. I think the Mad Dragon Shoes are the best, best for your money, extra dollar, two dollars, gets you more value, they last longer, and they feel better for the sleeves and the quality. So I highly rec recommend Dragon Shoes. What's going on, Paisanos V here? The cool part about living in a small town is people have random animal farms. Like, be careful! <laughs> what the hell? You testing me or something? Okay, 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 okay. <laughs>